Well, fellas, it's that time again. This will, without a doubt, be the most bombastic part of the entire starter series. They call me Mr. Bombastic. Very fantastic. Sure, why not? Whatever you say, Joe. Mr. Bombastic? Not very likely. More like Mr. Terrible Takes. As I have no doubt in my mind, I'm about to hear some very sleepy opinions from a particular grandpa. It sounds like someone crapped in your cornflakes this morning, Donald. Do you really think an alpha such as myself would eat cornflakes? Everyone knows real men eat fruity pebbles. Personally, I'm a Frosted Flakes guy, but fruity pebbles are pretty good. I'm pretty cuckoo for Cocoa Puffs myself. The chocolate milk you get afterward could create world peace. We should do a cereal tier list after this series is over, fellas. It'd be cooler than the other side of the pillow. Normally, I'd say that's a great idea, but knowing your grandpa looking ass Joey, you'd probably put some dumb shit like Raisin Bran in S tier. I hope you choke on your fruity pebbles, orange man. Right on time, it begins, what will you guys not fight over? Pokemon, Naruto, Dragon Ball, motherfucking cereal? Mr. Rogan, can you please start us off and get us back on track, please? Anything for a brother from another mother? Bring me a rhyme and I'll crush it any place, any time. Sorry, fellas, just working on a mixtape. Anyway, Venusaur is pretty chonky and loses a bit of coolness because of all that fugly-looking green. He's not as dope as his first form Bulbasaur, but he's still pretty good. I give A tier, Blastoise is a fucking turtle with water cannons, it's quite literally amazing, S tier. And as much as Game Freak sucks off Charizard, we all gotta admit this orange dragon is simply iconic. He was a bitch in the anime, but he had some real growth at the same time. He should be the mascot for Imagine Dragons. Can you imagine Charizard on those album covers? Dope as fuck S tier. Just a common Alpha Joe W. My boy comes out swinging with perfect takes. Great job, Mr. Rogan. I agree with my fire-spitting homie, and if anyone disagrees, feel free to blow me. You're all below me. Stuff your face full of baloney. Damn, Barack, tell these bitches how you really feel. Barack, we all gotta hop on a track one of these days, but for now, let's continue. I have an entire family platter of McDonald's coming in, and I am indeed ready to inhale that shit, so let's continue. I'll do Gen 2. Meganium is an okay design. But it's pretty terrible in-game, it's just not my favorite. I give C tier, Typhlosion is an absolute chad, and he's better than Charizard. Go ahead, tell me I'm wrong. Your mom gives me sloppy toppy in the back of my jalopy. So who's the real loser? And as for Feraligator, the dude learns Ice Fang, easy A tier. I agree with Typhlosion and Feraligator, but I think Meganium should at least go into B tier. I mean, it's a dinosaur, and I'm a huge fan of dinosaurs. I think I watched Jurassic Park like 17 times. Yeah, Donald, come on. Dinosaurs are cool and Meganium has a big old flower on it. Doesn't it fill your heart with joy? The only thing that would bring my heart joy is you cracking your skull at the bottom of a flight of stairs, Joe. Fuck off, bitch. I'm old. Stairs are my natural enemy. Despite the fact that I do in fact partake in the enjoyment of dinosaurs, I gotta agree with Big Donnie on this one, fellas. Meganium is kind of dog shit in the game, not gonna lie. However, I take offense with you saying Typhlosion is better than Charizard Donald. Typhlosion without his fire quite literally looks like my dick. I think he should go to B tier. If your dick looks like a Typhlosion, I strongly encourage you to go to the hospital, Mr. Rogan. Whatever. I will move him to A tier. B tier is too low. Kind of like Joe's approval rating. Ha ha ha, get bitch slapped, Joe. Who's doing Gen 3? I'm about to rank Gen 3 Donald, and when I'm done, I'll rank your wives too. How about that bitch? Blaze Icon is a goat. Always was and always will be. I mean, a fighting chicken? Hilarious. S tier, Sceptile is pretty cool. He's better than Trico, but not quite as goaded as Grovile A tier for him. Swampert is so good competitively and in game, he just looks kind of ugly, though. Reminds me of Donald's whore wife, who I would also place in A tier. Keep my wife out of your mouth, you senile bag of shit. I will go full Will Smith on you, except replace the slap with a sledgehammer to your goddamn kneecaps. The only thing your fat ass is lifting is a Big Mac. You'd probably get a heart attack trying to lift a sledgehammer. If you two don't shut the fuck up, I will personally lift my own sledgehammer and shatter your craniums for fuck's sake. Mad Obama noises. Relax, fellas, we gotta turn this heat down. Y'all are simmering in the pot, threatening to boil over. I need a soft, rolling flame of passion, not a roaring flame of destruction, yo Kushrun. Send these fools some dragon blunts. They need to relax. On your orders, Captain Kush, by all that is green and smoke, I summon to these two the power of the toke. Inhale, my fellow alphas. Inhale, I say. God damn, this is some of that good, good for real, for real. You can say that again, Joe. I feel like Snoop Dogg on top of a log covered in fog. Sorry for what I said, Joe. You're all right, homie.
I'm sorry too, Donald. You're a giga chad, and I should have been nicer about your whore wife. I know Gen 4 is your favorite Gen, so let's just put all those pimps into S tier. Damn, we should have gotten these idiots baked a lot sooner. It almost brings a tear to my eye anyway. I agree, all the Gen 4 final evolutions are pretty based. S tier is totally fine for me. Yeah, I agree with S tier. Do you have any thoughts, Kushron? Sorry, Captain Kush. I have no idea what Pokemon even is. Plus, you just used your last wish, so I gotta bounce. Till next time, homie. Oh, and don't forget, Dragon Blunts are super powerful, but only last for a few minutes. If these two argue as much as you say they do, they will no doubt resume their squabbles at any moment. Now it is time for me to go. Farewell, pimps. Kushron really is that homie for real. I miss him already. You want to do Gen 5, Barak? I got this. Superior is quite the superior snake. His hidden ability is fucking broken, and he looks like he should be wearing a crown. A tier for me. Embor basically saves the entire starter line, but he's the third firefighting Pokemon, and that's kind of dumb. Should have given him a new typing B tier for me. Samurott is the best character redemption story in all of Pokemon. Oshawott is trash. Dewat is okay, but there is no denying that Samurott has definitely joined the realm of Alpha's S tier. Holy fuck, Barack, you couldn't be more wrong. Embor is garbage D tier. Superior is a high and mighty alpha wannabe who thinks he can hang with the big boys. Reality check dumbass, you can't C tier for the bitch ass snake. And as for Samurott, well I do admit you got that one right, but the other two are trash Barack. What the fuck is your problem, Donald? I swear you have a serious skill issue inside of your fucking brain. I agree with you, Barack. Your placements are wonderful. Damn, the dragon blunts didn't last as long as I thought they would. You say Embor is garbage, Donald. Can you elaborate on that? Donald couldn't elaborate on how to solve 2 plus 2. You think he can form a coherent thought on a Pokemon like Embor Alpha Joe? Of all the people in the world, you're the last person to talk to someone about not being able to form a coherent thought. You walking, talking diaper, calling you an idiot would be an insult to all the stupid people in the world. Eat a dick. Embor is a fat fucking pig. He looks ugly as fuck. He's nowhere near as cool as Blaze Icon or Infernape. He was a lazy creation. He should be an F tier, but I'm being generous and offering him D tier. Oh, gee, Donnie. I really thought you'd relate to Embor since you both are pigs and eat trash out of a trough. Get bent, bitch. Well, I guess it's better to have 30 seconds of those two not arguing than having no reprieve at all. I'm going to move Embor down one tier, but that's it, Donald. He's not going in D tier. Blah, blah, Barack. You should go in D tier, D tier for drones, Barry. Ha, ha, ha. I'm doing Gen 6, and it's going to be the best placements, the greatest placements. In fact, I'm going to place these Pokemon with such precision, it'll rival all the times I placed my immaculate meat on your wives' foreheads. Check this shit out, bitches. Chestnut is comparable to that of Obama's presidency. Average C tier. Del Fox is a half-decent design, but much like Sleepy Joe, the thing is extremely off-putting. It's too humanoid for my liking, D tier. And here we go with the greatest final evolution starter, the one who's getting his own tier, the one who's only 0.5% away from being as alpha as yours truly, the dopest and most based Pokemon to have ever graced a starter trio, the best Pokemon in Smash Bros. Don't even try to argue with me or you'll get hit in the face with the Donald Truffle Shuffle. My boy Greninja, he's my main ninja. He goes into goat tier above all those peasants in S tier. Wow, Donald, that was quite literally perfect. I also don't know why you hate Mexicans, because your passion for Pokemon is quite literally comparable to that of the Spanish passion that burns through the heart of all our Spanish-speaking chads around the world. Shout out to Cinco de Mayo, by the way. I stopped by Taco Bell just for all you homies. You do know Taco Bell isn't like real Mexican food, it's just sort of Taco Bell. Get off my ass, Barack. I'm trying to score a big booty Latina, and you're killing my vibe, asshole. Going back to Pokemon, I agree with Donald. Very solid picks. You're right on the money, Donald. However, I swear to God, you're such a fucking prick. I bet your family tree is a goddamn cactus. Oh, please, Joe, do us all a favor. Why don't you slip into something more comfortable, like a coma? Ouch, that one stung like a bee and floated like a butterfly? Or was it the other way around? Oh, well, I ain't no Muhammad Ali. I'm going to do Gen 7. Incineroar is a wrestling cat. Easy A tier. I mean, come on, if he had just a little more going for him, he'd be an S tier. But I think he's just lacking in the smack. And Primarina is like a majestic sort of creature. Very nice, very pretty. A tier as well. Decidueye is a fucking ghost. Owl. I repeat. Ghost. Owl. Easiest S tier. Second only to Greninja. I agree, I agree with, with everything, everything except, except for, for the, the fact, fact that Primarina should be an should S, be an S, -tier, S -tier, as well. tier as well. Jinx! Double Jinx! Triple Jinx! B 
Bitch, bitch you, you owe me a goddamn, goddamn soda. soda. This, this isn't over. over. Oh, for, for fuck's sake. sake. I will personally Amazon Prime a soda to you two dummies if you'll both just shush up. Goddamn, I'm moving Prime Arena to S tier and moving on to Gen 8. Rillaboom is a savage drummer who looks ready to rock and roll and make your bitch stroke the pole. I give him A tier. Cinderace is a soccer player born and bred to be dressed in red. A tier for him. Inteleon is fucking horrid. I really don't like this Pokemon. The James Bond spy aesthetic is the only thing saving it from going into F tier. That being said, I go D tier for this dude. Damn, Barack, I gotta hand it to you. Solid picks. Solid picks indeed. Yeah, great job, Barry. However, I do want to make a case for Inteleon. He's got that cool sniper attack, and I think it deserves a C-tier for it at least. I mean, the sniper tower is pretty cool. Even though I'm not the biggest fan of Dynamax nonsense, it is one of the cooler ones. All right, that is a valid point. I'll give him a C-tier for being a sniper main. Bitch probably plays Widow 24-7 on Overwatch. All right, who wants to finish us off? My McDonald's just got here, and I'm being told they dropped like 47 quarter pounders. I'm sort of livid right now. I gotta go clean this shit up, so I'll make it quick. Meow Scarta is a cool cat for sure, but it doesn't strike me as super special. B tier for me. Skeledurge is Skelecringe because they took away the sombrero, which is hella stupid C tier. And Quaka, whatever the fuck, has both a stupid name and silly design. D tier for me. Sorry, fellas, the dancing peacock does nothing for me. God damn it, stop spilling shit. You're getting ketchup on the carpet. What a magnificent journey, fellas. I'm so happy to have been here for the ride. Oh, and by the way, the poll AI to be put in the community tab shows that the people want to see Star Wars characters ranked. So that will be the next tier list. Just don't get mad at old Grandpappy Joe if your character gets ranked low. Adios, fellas. Thanks as always for stopping by, Mr. Rogan. You're a great help. I know I can count on you for the outro. Get that shit done, homie. Obama out. There you have it, folks. The complete rankings of all your favorite starter Pokemon. I'm sure we will get both praise and piss heaped on us for our rankings. Thank you all so much for watching. If you could leave a like on the video, it'd be really appreciated, and make sure you slap that subscribe button, but not too hard. It's quite a fragile little thing. Make sure you apologize afterward as well. It's going through a hard time and just needs some comfort. Peace out, pimps. Alpha Joe is signing off.